Okay, folks, we are going to learn how to tag a photograph. Okay, so here's a folder with some photographs in it. I'm going to right click on one. And there we go. And I go all the way down here to properties. Okay, so you got general, you got security, and you got details. And that's what I'm going to click on. Now I'm going to go over to my notepad folder I have here and this is the posting information that I use when I do internet marketing online marketing whatever this is the information I use for Palm Coast magazine I haven't used it yet because I haven't got my website up yet so I have nothing to promote online but this right here is my title Palm Coast magazine with the vertical bar in there and then life in Palm Coast. So I'm going to copy this and this is going to be the title of this photograph. Okay, I'm going to click right here on title. I'm going to paste this in. There you go. Alright, now we're going to go to tags. And these are tags or keyword phrases, keyword search phrases. These are things you might use to search for things. Now let's say I want to go to do something in Palm Coast. Well we've got Palm Coast events, we've got Palm Coast activities, we've got Palm Coast restaurants, Palm Coast shopping. Okay, these are, these are terms that I think people would search for if they wanted to do something in Palm Coast. So we're going to copy this, and we're going to stick this in the tags field right here. Okay, and now you can either use subject, the subject field, or comments field. Doesn't really matter which one, but um, Actually, if I wanted to, if I wanted to, I could just put in the subject field Palm Coast. Okay, and I always do that when I type. Um, but in either one, let's say comments, what I'm going to put in here is this description. Now, this is a description of my website. And you'll notice that there is at the very beginning, right here, this is my URL. Google's going to see this. Okay, Google's going to know that it, this is associated with my website. And then these are all the same as these down here. I just put the tags in. You can put other information up here. I say read about Palm Coast events and then the list of the tags. You can put anything else you want up here, but it's not really going to help you. Okay, um, this stuff is what Google, Google's going to see and what's going to make a difference. So now we've got the comments field done. Now I'm going to rate my photo. I, I always give my photos five star ratings. I don't know if Google differenti differentiates between one star and five star, but I'm going to make mine all five star. Okay, you click apply. Okay, and now you're done. That photo is going to show up on the internet when at any time somebody searches for one of those search terms. These right here. Okay, that photo can be brought up by Google now. The only Thing we don't know is will it be the, the first photo that Google pulls up or the 300th photo or the 3000th photo. It's probably going to rate really close because I doubt that there's many people that are tagging photos or anything really with those type of search terms here at the Palm Coast. Okay, your business is going to be different obviously. You're going to tag yours differently and, and, and depends on how many people search for those terms. It depends on how many other uh, items on the internet, and they can be videos, photos, web pages, have that term on them. Palm Coast events, or Palm Coast restaurants, or whatever. Or if yours is, um, you know, Palm Coast uh, exterminators, right? If uh, if I owned Eagle uh, Pest Solutions, I hope that's the correct name. <laughs> um, but if I owned uh, that company, that's maybe a search term that I would use. Anyway. You can use this to make your Google business pages um, more uh, searchable, more findable, let's call it, from Google. All these photos that you put up on your, on your Google page, uh, your business page, tag every one of those. Um, any photos you put anywhere that, that you might put on any website, okay? Tag every photo that you have that you're going to use for your business because everywhere you put it, it's going to work the same way and it's going to help you get more traffic and it's going to raise your, especially if you put a link like I did in the description, 
uh, you put a link to your website, it's going to raise your um, searchability, let's call it, with Google. They're going to be able to find you easier and you're going to come up before other people's websites do. Okay? You got questions, I can answer them later. But basically, that's all it is. So, thanks for listening and watching and uh, see you soon.